Okay, this lesson is about relations and not the girl guy relations, mathematical relations. Does take two though. Okay, so the 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 type that you're most familiar with up till now, well, maybe are the ordered pairs. That's looking at numbers as an ordered pair. So here's an example of an ordered pair. Ordered pairs show that numbers, they're a relation. Okay, well there's more than one way to, to show these relations. You can take those ordered pairs and you can put them into a table. So remember, if you say the alphabet, a, B, C, D, blah, 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 X, Y, Z. X always comes before Y. So there's the X value, there's the Y value. There's the X value, Y, X, Y, X, Y, X, Y. So now you've put those values, that relation, and you've displayed them in a table. This is also a relation. Another way to express this relation is through a mapping. So I'm going to put 0, 1, 2, 3, 4 here, and I'm going to mix these numbers up. All right, so notice I put the x values, also called the domain, in order uh, least to greatest, and I kind of randomly uh, selected the Y values. But the important thing is you need to match up the value that that has a relationship with which other value. So if we look at the ordered pair up here, 0 and 1 have a relationship. So, And the arrow always starts from the X value. It does not start from the Y values. And then 1 relates with 3, 2 relates with 5, 3 relates with 7, and 4 relates with 9. This is another expression of a relation. And then if you graph those ordered pairs, so 0, 1, 1, 3, whoops, I made a mistake there. Sorry about that. 0, 1, and 1, 3, and I was starting over on the 1, and then at 2 we go up to 5, and at 3 we go up to 7, and at 4 we go up to 9. And Wow, I s still didn't do a great job with that, but anyway, um, this also shows a relation. Show. So here are several ways to show a relation, and the important thing to remember the domain is always the X values, the range, all the Y values. So on a graph, the horizontal axis is the X, are the X values, the vertical axis is the Y values. In a table, X and Y. In a mapping, X is before the Y, and the arrows always start from the X, go to the Y, and in ordered pairs. Just alphabetically, we read left to right, X, Y. That's it. That's all you have to do. So I hope you have an understanding of what, there's some deeper meanings to this that I'll get into later, but for now, if you were asked, how do you show a relation, relations in numbers? Well, you could say ordered pairs, a mapping or an arrow diagram, a table, a graph.